Welcome back to Homegrown Country Home Safe, friends. How y'all doing today? I don't know if y'all can hear it. It's raining outside, and I thought I'd give y'all a quick update on my little seedlings right here. Um, they've been planted probably at least, I don't know, about two and a half weeks, maybe close to three weeks now. And I just want to give y'all an update on them. Um, what I used there, I uh, went to Walmart and uh, seen these uh, shelves in there. They're about $15 a piece. And I thought they'd work out real good. And uh, normally I put my plants and seeds on the table and do it that way. But uh, I decided to do something a little bit different this year. And I seen them. And I uh, said, so, well, instead of building some shelves, I just uh, buy these and have it done with. So that's what I'm using as far as my uh, shelving right there. And on my lights right here, what I use is uh, just, a, just a regular, like a four-foot shop light and um i got daylight bulbs in them my brother he let me um borrow these i normally take these out of my shop and um but he had some extra ones there he wasn't using so he let me use them and uh it's working out real good and uh all i did here i just drilled a hole in the top right here and uh secured it from side to side and just pulled a chain through and stuck my nail in there that way I can adjust the light, you know, up and down as I need to. But um, just want to show you that. And right here is a a Negro light that I bought uh, this year off eBay. And uh, I'm trying it out. And I'll be honest with you, uh, I don't know just the color up, just not used to it. Uh, you see, it lets off in all them different colors. I may uh, unplug it and try to use. Uh, just my regular, you know, fluorescent lights right here. Because I know they work real good. But uh, in a pinch right there, I've got it in case I need it. And uh, like I said, I, I don't know if, how good it works. I, I really don't want to take a risk, to be honest with you, uh, trying it you know, on my plants that I'm going to be needing, you know, to put out. Um, I should should have planted me some extra ones, I guess. And just if it worked, it worked. If it didn't, but uh, I didn't do that but uh i've had these right here up under my other light and i decided to put put them up under here see how it does and um i can't i can't really say it, it, there's a not growing uh you can tell right there that they're coming on up uh, but um i don't think i'm gonna take a chance on them i think i'm gonna put these right back down here on my four foot lights and uh well i know they work real good so anyway right here that's my cucumber plants right there uh, different ones um, got a couple pepper plants back through here and uh, you can see they're doing real good I haven't watered them this morning uh, I usually water them about every couple days and um, it's time to water them so I'll be doing that when I get through this video um, right here you see my uh, pepper plants and a couple tomato plants and stuff now these uh, I planted about a week later, and uh, I was actually going to uh, use these right here up under this other light as a comparison. But since I didn't get started all the same time on these particular ones, I said it wouldn't really be a, a fair comparison. But I've noticed uh, once I put these up under this light, it seemed like <laughs> maybe just me, it seemed like they taken off real good. So. Uh, Anyway, I think that's another reason I'm going to take my other ones right here and uh, put them back up under my shop lights because uh, I, I don't I don't want these to uh, not do as good because these are my main ones right here. I definitely want to get these uh, started real good. Right down here, you can see I've got a lot of squash uh, plants right here and they're really shooting up and a couple of cantaloupe plants. I've got cantaloupe plant right there sees I planted nothing came up in that and but uh normally uh, all uh, the like say cucumber and uh, squash and cantaloupe any of them type I normally plant them out in mounds and uh, just by you no know, directly sowing my seed in the mound of dirt but um uh, all this rain and stuff we've been getting I thought I might try to get a head start and Get them planted in here because i really don't know when i'll be able to uh, 
get these set out and these really need to be set out right now but i tell you we've been getting rain for probably uh, i can't keep up with now a couple weeks now and uh but anyway that's my plants i got going so far and how the setup i got and uh, like i say if you uh you can use just whatever you have like i say normally i'll just take my shop light out of my shop and bring them in the house and uh but my brother let me use these right here so i didn't have to do that and uh, that saved me some time and haven't taken them out of my shop and, but anyway i just want to bring y'all along today show you my plants how they're coming along and i appreciate y'all watching and i um, hope everybody's uh, staying safe out there and as always for my family to yours y'all have a blessed day friends we'll see you later bye bye